Hey guys, it's me, Melissa, and welcome back to my channel. Today we got another round of Wish Limited Quantity Deals. If you guys must probably know about this already by now, but if you don't, I'll tell you a little bit about it. So in the USA, these are items that are 50 cents with 25 cents shipping. Now I know in other countries, like Canada, it's a dollar worth of dollar shipping. These are just random items that show up in your feed. Let me show you kind of what they look like so you'll know. Some of you guys have asked. So you'll see at the bottom, it'll say limited quantity deal. Now you'll see them just gonna kind of like says almost gone. You'll just see them kind of randomly show up in your feed, just randomly. Sometimes it goes by kind of things you've already searched for. So say you, you really want to get something, you could try to search for a genre of something and maybe you'll see them show up in your limited quantity deals. Now there are only one available of the item per 24 hour period. So the chances obviously are hard. And now that I've given all the tips, it's a lot harder for me to claim. So you're not alone. But I've had a couple of you get that um, Mira jewelry holder that you put it over the door. Touche. Good job. Um, usually I've been buying like seven to ten items a day. I try not to go crazy and go overboard because that's a lot of refunds and it's just like you don't want to waste your money. And what I try to do now, which I think is making it harder, is I literally only try to go for things that I really, really want or I think that I can sell. Because otherwise, like, why do I want a bunch of crap? Even if it's only 75 cents, why do I want a bunch of crap? I don't. So we got 12 items today, which would equal $9. We got the non-clothing items, clothing items, and then the big boy, which obviously you saw on the thumbnail, so you know what the big boy is, but we'll do that last. I like to do, like, the most fun or the most work to put together or take apart or whatever. So at least I can get all this stuff done and then, like, clean the room out and then do that thing. But I'm excited. So if you don't know how to claim, the way we think you can claim is the top of the hour. So literally the top of the hour, about three or four or five seconds later, refresh your page and buy as quick as you can. A lot of people say you want to buy within the first 30 seconds. Some people say the first minute. I mean, I just buy, if I don't find anything that was the first like 45 seconds to a minute, I don't buy that hour. But it's completely up to you, whatever you want to do. There's just a wide variety of stuff too. I mean, you can get stuff from, you know, electronics all the way to clothing to baby stuff. I mean, it's just crazy the amount of stuff you can get. And for 75 cents. Now, a lot of you know that processing times are taking a little bit longer. The arrival dates are a little bit longer. I think it's the whole like situation in the world right now is making things go a little bit longer. I've even had some items that haven't shown up yet and they're late. And it's just to sit there and try to grow, scroll through and try to find everything. It's just, I might just let the 75 cents go and hope that it shows up at some point. Or one day if I'm free, I'll just literally try to find all those items. But a lot of times you'll go back and then you'll find they change the date on you. All right, without further ado. Oh, also, if you're new to Wish and haven't um, or haven't shopped in the last 30 days, I have a promo code for you to save up to 80% off, max $25 value. I think right now it's still only USA, but I'll let you guys know if it goes otherwise. And I wouldn't waste this code on a limited quantity deal because the chances of you getting the limited quantity deal are not high. I mean, they might be high, <laughs> depending on what you're getting. But, so I wouldn't waste your code on that, but if you want to buy some other stuff, you know, I would use that code. It's supposedly it's the best one out there. Okay, without further ado, that was only three, three and a half minutes of me jabbering on. So the first item I got, it said it was 47 inches by 71 inches and $19 what it would have been. That's the total cost plus shipping together. It says right here, 120 centimeters by 180. Now, how long it take me to get in it? So this is the tablecloth. Now, not every single item I will be like fully testing out on, on, on this video. As you've seen, if you've seen my other limited quantity deals, I get a lot of these to sell because if I sell a lot of bunch of stuff, I can literally buy more things in town to do more videos. It's all about like the cycle. So this is just a big, long, glittery tablecloth. <laughs> Let's just see if it's like mega see-through or what. So like I can see you, but you might not be able to see me. Can you see me? No, you really can't see me. So this will be good for a tablecloth. Now keep in mind, if you're gonna use this for oh, glitter, if you use this for a tablecloth, if any stains on this thing, you're not washing it. <laughs> you're not getting it out. But they all seem to be on pretty darn good. I was thinking it could also be good for like a backdrop, or if I want to take a picture of something I'm trying to sell and make it look prettier by having it on this thing. But it seems like pretty decent quality to me. Yeah. I'm happy with that. I don't think I would use it. Like, I guess people, some people will say, like, well, so use it at your wedding. I mean, who knows? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. But, like, if you use it for something, like, I guess you could use it at a wedding for, like, the 
present table or something like that and it wouldn't get like stained but we'll see what happens to it all right this next item would have been 27 dollars. i tried for this a bunch of times I've, and a lot of these things like i'm opening and like trying on and doing everything just as we're doing it so i haven't tested stuff out so if i seem like i don't know something or i can't figure something out that's why i don't try to pre-do this because then it's like not as exciting like i'm not figuring out as you're figuring it out so it comes in a box like this and it's this globe thing like you see like the constellation or whatever and then a stand and then it comes with batteries i'm going to well, there's a pull tab here i'm going to put the batteries in get it all set up and then we'll take a look so actually there were three batteries already inside of it and so these are just like backup batteries that's pretty nice so here we go can you see it? It's changing colors. I'm so worried. This is like complete glass. I'm so worried that I'm going to drop it. So now it's like green. It's probably hard to tell. Maybe you can tell better with the lights off. Yeah. I guess you can put it wherever. Oh, look, that's better. Ooh. That's different. I'm guessing in, the only way to turn it off would be to take the batteries out because there's no on and off switch on it. But that is something neat, huh? All right. Turn these lights back on. Try not to break this. And let's see. Yeah, if you, if you unscrew just a little bit, then the light will turn off. So that's good. I'll probably keep that. I might try to sell it. I don't know. You just gotta be definitely be careful because I just kind of put it in a little bit and it's turned back on again. So I'm guessing that's why they gave you a second set of batteries. All right. Well, that one was fun. What's next? Okay, this would have been $27, and this is a flat iron. I don't really need a flat iron, so we're just going to test it out and make sure it works. And then I will put it away to probably sell. Ooh, that's a Babilis? Babilis Nano? In this box? So this is a Babilis Nano. That's a nice flat iron. My flat iron is a Babilis. And it doesn't look as nice as this one. Maybe I'll keep it. <laughs> I actually have two flat irons. <laughs> but maybe I'll sell another one. Really? Is it like a generic one? Is it like fake? And let's see, you can put the temperature up. There's the up and down for the temperature. What does this do? Oh, nothing. I think it locks it. I don't know how that works, but I'm guessing that right there, the top one, is a lock. Because it goes right into here, so I'm guessing this locks it. I probably just have to read the instructions. It's not like a quick little push and done. Did I turn it off? <laughs> My bad. Alright, so I'm just going to let this sit and heat up. And then we'll give it like, what I like to do with my flat iron sometimes is just do like a sniff test. You can see if it's hot. And if it gets hot, then it's nice. I mean, Babilis? Really? What, what a generic, crappy box to put this in. <laughs> if this is the real deal, like, I'm going to have to look up afterwards on Amazon and see if the exact same one is on there and see how much it is. That's pretty sweet. All right, what's next? While I heat up, so this one, it says $48, it would have been $48, $18, I think it might have been $18, it got smudged, <laughs> I, think it was, I think it was $18, this is something definitely for sure that I'll be selling, but I'll show it to you, so these are the things that you do with your kids to help them learn how to do stuff, like learn how to button, Learn how to buckle, lace, tie, snap, zip. Well, that's pretty neat. I've seen these going around and I've seen, um, I don't even sure if Allison has something like this, but I've seen these going around like these are a really great way to teach your kids kind of how to do these things. Especially like lacing a shoe. It can be a difficult thing to learn for a child. 
And if you could practice on something not like leaning down on your, your foot, it might be like easier for them to learn. And, and even like buttoning, I'm pretty sure when your hands are like all little and it's hard to figure all that stuff out. So this is a great way where they can practice it. And it's not like a hard, like a hard cardboard S type inside of this thing. So that's very neat. All right, checking back. Ooh, that's hot. That is hot. I'm gonna turn it off. Wow, I'm looking forward to looking this up to see kind of what's what in that situation. I don't wanna melt anything. We'll put that over there for now. Like that. All right, what's next? So this would have been $57. Now I know you've seen that I bought or claimed um, a nail kit before. This one, I'm not gonna go crazy and show you every single little thing that's in it. Then I won't go crazy, but 40, 40 gel polishes, 40. I'll take one out to show you. They all come, and every single one comes individually wrapped in a neat little bag. Which, I'm not going to lie, I kind of like these little bags. Like, I might keep the bags and sell it without the bags. Because you don't really need them. Nobody's going to store them in the bags at home. So, they're not huge. It says they're 0.28 ounces. But that's the brand of them. And then, does it say, and then, does it say the color? I guess that's the color of the bag, 08, A08, I'm guessing. Um, I'll put the picture of the kit, and then I'll show you the picture of all the different colors that come in the set. But, I mean, come on, 40 gel polishes. And then, to think, 40 gel polishes alone, even if you paid a dollar for each, that's $40 right there. Now, tack on. One of these LED lamps that has, what is the charging thing? Is it batteries? Is it a charger? I don't know where the hookup is. Oh, right here. So there's the hookup. Is there a cord in here? I don't remember seeing a cord. Cord in here. So you have that, it has a USB, um, I guess we'll test it out. That's one thing I did forget. All right, let me get my charging block. We'll test that out and then I'll show you the rest of the stuff that was in the box. All right guys, so it's good to go, totally works. Easy to turn on, it has the different functions of the, I guess, time. I guess time. I don't use gel polish, but I know a lot of people do. And then on top of that, you get your informational packets, then you got these little cards where you can put your gel polish on so you can know which one's which. Little nail tips that you can use. Nail removing wipes. I'm gonna try with this fast. A bunch of different files. One of these toe separators. These tweezer things. Cuticle oil. These two like cuticle type tools cuticle pushers. These, which are nail cleaners. A big thing of jewels, or whatever you want to call them. Tons of nail tape. Gold and silver nail tape. Nail bond glue, a buffer, a nail brush, and then finally a pair of nail clippers. I mean, that's a lot of stuff. Now I gotta clean this up. So I'm gonna clean this up and then we'll continue on. And I will say that the nail stuff does sell pretty quickly. Like people are really obsessed about nail stuff and because I sell things so reasonable, like they go pretty fast. Also so you know, I pre-film my videos. So by the time this comes out and I also only sell locally, by the time this comes out, all this stuff will be gone. I promise you. <laughs> all right, so this also came bubble wrap, but I took it out so I can just, you know, not have all this crap up here. It would have been $39 and it is the 80 piece there's different amounts you can get. The 80 piece marker set. Like, I've won, I claimed this before a long time ago when they were doing the dollar with a dollar shipping. And it sold pretty quickly. But look at all of those colors. So I figure we can just test one out. We'll just grab one. These should be dual sided. So you have a thick side. 
and then you have a thin side. So I'm just going to test them both out. Looking good. Yeah. So good to go. I mean, especially if you like drawing, and I'm guessing this could be used, it might even said like fabric markers, but a marker is a marker, and it comes in a case. I mean, it's fancy. <laughs> like I said, it sold quickly before, and 80 colors, that's a lot. I mean, you go pick up like a couple of Sharpies and it's like $5 alone. Now, the next item, non-clothing item, besides the big boy, I'll put this down here too. Oh. It's always limited quantity deals is the one video, one videos or videos that like over here just becomes a disaster area. <laughs> now this one I tried to claim so many times. This would have been $38. There were different options. You could get it just the wallet. You could get the wallet and the purse. I got the wallet and the purse. So it came like this. You can probably already see it. So in the dark, it looks just regular like a just like a matte gray but then in the light it shines like this isn't even is like doing it justice i'm getting a wallet out i haven't decided if i'm gonna keep this or i'm gonna sell it because it is one of the things that i tried so long for it so like you probably can't see like see how it's like starting to get whereas like you turn that off it's like darker and if you turn it really bright this really isn't doing it justice. I think I'm going to have to take a picture of it because that's what it really shows up if you show it like in flash. So this wallet, I mean, sorry, this purse is a zip top with a snap. Inside it also comes with, oh, this is way too bright now. <laughs> Inside it comes with a strap too. You can make it a long strap. And this is the inside of it. And it has a couple non-zipper pockets in there. And then the other side has a zipper pocket. Then the wallet. It's a pretty decent wallet. Got a zipper part. Actually, I mean, I might definitely maybe just keep the wallet. <laughs> I'm not sure yet. So I'm going to try to, let's see, if I can just take a picture right here while we're sitting here. And then I can just show you. But I know, like... Maybe you guys have seen this one. It's pretty sweet. See camera. Flash. Flash turned on. Oh, I have the There we go. So that's what it looks like in the flash. I don't know if it looks like that exactly like outside in the sun. Should I go outside? But look at that. That's crazy, right? Like here you see a little bit of it, but not like that. Like that is epic. I feel like I'm clipping this a lot. Like I'm having to cut a lot, but I think I'm gonna go outside real quick without you guys and see if this glit shines or glistens the same way. Maybe I'll bring it. So it only works with flash, but that was pretty neat though, right? Like what it showed them in a flash. Like if you were taking a, like a Insta photo, like you'd be like super like, crazy cool looking like every supposedly this was like trending a long time ago i don't know i'm not a trending girl but i'm glad i finally got it so now we have the clothing items i think i'm going to show them all back to back and then we'll just try them on back to back all right this one right here i got an extra large it would have been 16 dollars. i got this for my cousins they're obsessed with friends they won't mind if i try it on it was pretty decent quality for extra large, it doesn't seem that big. We'll see. But for an extra large, it doesn't seem that big. It, it is that, like, cheesier, thinner type sweatshirt material. So you gotta, like, be careful. But may, may not be washing, like, good for, like, forever. But at least, you know, you'll have it for a little bit. So I'll try that on. It definitely doesn't look like an extra large. I'm hoping... If, as long as they don't mind it being... Not being, like, oversized. I'm pretty sure one of them will love it. So that's that. Next, we have this. I got in a medium, and it would have been $24. It's like, this is one that I should not have tried for. 
This is one that I just thought would maybe look funny or be funny, and that's why I got it. But the chances of me like wearing this are kind of slim. So it's like a hoodie, but all the way down. But like a long hoodie, no, <laughs> like to the floor long hoodie in a medium. Is it the same medium on here? It does not. This is the brand, <laughs> or the brand's right here on here. It'll be funny. All right, next thing I got in a 2XL because I got it for my dad. Hopefully this hopefully this will fit him because usually he likes to, in his sweatshirts, he likes to have an extra large. So if this is not true to size at all, we're going to have a hard time. So it is the Enjoy Coca-Cola. This looks a lot bigger. I think this will fit him. I'm going to try it on too anyway because he doesn't care if I try anything on either. But yeah. This is actually way better quality than the Friends one. Like a thicker type sweatshirt material. It's got the, the thing for your hands. Ooh, he will like this. If you guys have watched my videos, you know my dad likes some Coke. It also came in red, but I figured he would like black better. And then this one, I don't know, guys. I don't know. <laughs> this one, I got 13 to 14 years old. It would have been $28. If I don't think it'll fit me in any way, shape, or form, I'm not going to try it on. But it looked kind of like... Oh, it comes with... Oh, this is... Well, hold on. So it's like a... Actually, that looks decently sized. Is it? Is it my wedding dress? <laughs> no, just kidding. <laughs> the parts right here are like kind of weird. Like they're all just like apart. And it has this... What do you call that? Like a brooch or a pin on it? And a weird random clip. Oh! The clip was stuck to here and it popped off. So we don't need that clip anymore. I thought that if it didn't fit, like it would be funny to try on, but then if it didn't fit me, I could try to sell it for a communion dress or something, but I don't even know about that. <laughs> the back ties up. I don't know if I'm able to make that happen. We'll see how it goes. I don't know guys. <laughs> All right, let's try these on. And here it is, guys. Definitely not an extra large. <laughs> in normal, like, U.S. size extra large. Maybe this is extra large in Chinese extra large. But I'm pretty sure that the girls either, I'm guessing either, I, I think all, all three of them like friends. I mean, it looks legit. And it's a thinner type sweatshirt. This would be good for them up there in, like, fall or, like, spring when it's still cool. Or just to wear to bed. I don't really care. It was 75 cents. <laughs> and I know they'll be excited. Yeah, not bad. All right, on to the extremely long zip up. And here it is, guys. I mean, it's got like the slits on the side. You could even wear this as a dress. Does it have pockets? Oh, yeah, it has pockets too. I mean, and it has a hoodie that you can put on. I mean, I don't know. I'm not like completely hating it. Like, it'd be, this would be a good like throw and go something. And if you wanted to, you could even wear it open. And medium is pretty much true to size. If you wanted to, you could even just wear it open like a big, long jacket. I was talking smack. I take it back. All right, now for my dad's sweatshirt. And here is the Coca-Cola sweatshirt. I think it should fit him. Like, look how long it is, like the, even the arms on me. And it's pretty big. And I didn't even notice that it has the Coca-Cola symbol on the back too. I mean, this is a legit sweatshirt. Like, unlike a lot of the sweatshirts you get that just, you know that they're, like, too thin and they're, like, cheesy, this actually feels like a real sweatshirt. I think that he is going to love this. Yeah, I mean, I would even wear this if it doesn't fit him for some reason. I would even keep it and just wear it. For 75 cents. Yes. Now for the, now for the child's dress. How is this going to go? Cross and fingers. Here it is, guys. <laughs> Obviously not my size. I mean, unless you wanted to wear it, like, really open. You could totally wear it, like, really open and have it fit. So I guess it's, like, can be sized nicely. I don't know what all this is. I don't know what this is. I mean, if they didn't go crazy with all this stuff or maybe had just one, like, straight down thing like that, it would have been better. This is for a child. <clears throat> I know. It's... <laughs> 
It's not for an adult. I mean, this could be saved maybe for a Halloween costume where you're like people that do like the dead bride or something. Or if I want to be funny, I could like save it for my, if I do a bachelorette party, save it for the bachelorette party and just be looking like the entire body like, hey everybody, just dress like super silly and stupid. That's what we're going to do. <laughs> so that, that could be a, <laughs> a thing. I mean, it's not the awfulest quality. This thing's a little weird and how it disconnected. But like all this is just a little, little much, a little much. What does it do when I spin? Well, that's kind of fun. All right, let me get this off. And since you guys know that the next thing we're doing is the guitar, I'm going to probably take the thumbnail, get a few things out, and then we'll kind of get into the, the big daddy. I got the electric guitar set. This would have been $102. It was express shipping. It came, I think, in less than a week. It came in different colors, but you know, when you're trying to act fast, I didn't pick green. I really didn't care. So electric guitar comes with an amp, guitar case, guitar strap, the thing to hook up the amp to, and a whammy bar, a pick, and a couple little tools. I mean, I don't know how to play guitar. My dad just started picking up guitar. He had to get a left-handed guitar. When I was younger, I had a guitar, but I found that my finger, my pinky, would not reach the last chord. And I tried and tried and tried, and it just did not work for me. So let's just make sure this works. Obviously, nothing I'm about to do is going to sound good. I may I also try to play, like, a chord. Now, I also don't even know if this thing is in tune or whatever. But, I mean, come on, guys. Electric guitar for 75 cents. Whenever you get something like this, it's one of those things you're just like, you're on a high for a good amount of time. So I'm hoping maybe I can even sell this for like 80 bucks. You know, how big of an influx is that? All right, we're plugged in, hopefully. <laughs> yeah, it's coming out of there. I won't try to embarrass myself. Let's see, volume. All right, I'm turning the volume up. And it's got like treble, bass, gain, grind, mp3, and a headphone jack. I'm not gonna try. I used to be able to play that. Ding, 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 ding. I used to be able to play that. That was the only I could play, but I'm not even gonna attempt anymore. I mean, Becca112, after me. I mean, I'm, I'm, this, this was, what do they say, like, your big something, like your, your big win. Now it makes me, now it's been making me try for things that are harder, and I've been losing a lot, but, I mean, in case you want to see it up close. Now, they, they did put it as a beginner's guitar, which, obviously, I know this is not the coolest guitar probably you've ever seen in your life, but even my dad said he bought a beginner's guitar, I think it came with all the stuff that came here. I think on Amazon, he paid $150. 75 cents I paid. So I got a lot of great things today. As always, I think I'm going to try to start doing um, them into like this many items. What did I do today? <laughs> 12 items? 12 items? <laughs> About 12 items. So then in turn, we can have more of these available because I'm, I'm still waiting for a lot of stuff to come. Hopefully it'll come soon, but you just never know. I'm going to try to do these limited quantity deals once a month and do another wish haul. But if I start getting a lot in, I might do two limited quantity deals in one month. I don't know. So if you have any questions about limited quantity deals, feel free to ask. Um, I try to get back and figure out all the stuff you guys say and ask and try to remember to put it in a video. But I will put the link to the one where I tell you how to claim in the description box. So if you want to just watch the beginning part of that, it goes a little bit more in depth. Um, and showing you my phone and kind of how I kind of do things so I don't have to say it like on every single video So if you like this video give it a thumbs up if you have any comments or any questions Please put them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible if you haven't yet subscribed Why the heck not? Why the heck not? <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. I'll see you soon. Bye